Hello and welcome to another episode of Social Media Trends on Base Star TV. Base Star TV, yes. I'm Abigail Mom. And I'm Theresa Osing. How Giving you trends for the week, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. How's your week been so far? Been good, been good, been good. Um, you know, we have to get more stories, more filler, yes. you know, for the viewers. viewers. So let's go straight into social media. What has been trending this week, Theresa? Well, a lot, but you know, the one that really made headlines was the xylophone, Buhaha, yes. Stone Boy, being attacked, broken bottles, a whole lot. Bulldog, so also coming for, in the for, picture. For, I for mean, those of you who don't know what's happened at xylophone, there has been a little bit of controversy. Mm. So, people, rumors saying uh, Stone Boy is leaving, uh, he has problems with his management because of Shatawali. But then on Monday, no, not Monday, on Wednesday, Wednesday actually, they released yeah. a press statement okay. saying that all their artists or all their signees are still on the label and yeah. no one has left. So nothing is wrong. Nothing and is happening. Yes, yeah, so th that's actually good news. Camp of um, Stone Boy and, and xylophone. xylophone. And actually, um, Nanapia, as uh, number one, people call um, him. affectionately call him. Um, has yep, come to apologize, yeah, he apologize to, to Stoneboy, Stoneboy and for the incident, know, the robbery, and the everything that happened. And actually, yes. the um, the transport manager was actually um, sacked. Really? Yeah, the transport manager at um, Xylophone, Xylophone was sacked because was sacked. I, I, I heard he spearheaded the movement the for the collection oh, of the castle. That's, that's and that bad. was a wrong move. You know, that in was house. a wrong move. Wrong <laughs> in move. house. If you're so, all hey, people. <laughs> hey, you know you are carrying that wrong move. You know, your boss this, your boss that. You don't know. You, you, you'll be sacked for that. Uh, situation when you are involved in that situation you should take time and know and uh, the processes for which i mean things can be done at the right time and at the right places exactly. so yes this person was i don't know his name is not really out but he was sacked and also the bigger story you know okay. kumi guitar kumi guitar kumi, kumi guitar we he had it finally he has a dream <laughs> his dream he's finally had yes. a dream of trending everywhere social the media twitter oh kumiwa. i don't know if you've seen that picture of oh, him I, I, with I, a belly. I, I meant, um his fans will be actually called um kumijin strings oh i just heard that interesting. interesting so if you're a fan of so can i call you kumi oh yeah <laughs> it's funny how it took you a very short while to write this of course, music you know, he, he needed it for his brand his oh story, he, his he has a martin luther king high life martin luther king he did very very well but actually that um, for me, it was a wrong move for me, but for him, it's a big, big story because mm -hmm. he actually wanted that high for yes. his new video, new song, which is and Between And he got her. it, actually. And he got it, he got He's it. He's been the whole movement of... Uh, Even if it's negative, he, he has the press and so, that's Charlie, all that matters. I want to say kudos to Ashes, that's his manager, I heard. Yes. And, and also the guitar, and also the xylophone team because it has really created a whole... Uh, I mean, xylophone, xylophone has been churning this whole, whole year. Whole week. Even two weeks, <laughs> yes. Because I even uh, there's been rumor that Stone Boy is booked for a show which Xylophone is not had no aware. idea about. Yes. So you you see the movie. Yeah, now, and then so I I, I read a headline that uh, Xylophone was issuing a warning that they shouldn't use their artists without their yes, permission. Yes, yes, that that is the move. But you know, every time, every day, things pop up. So yeah. when that pops up, you're gonna give you that filler. Okay, <laughs> so let's go straight to the camp of bullets. Hmm, the manager of late Ebony Reigns, may her soul rest in perfect member peace. of Robin's mood. So that's Bullet. Yes. Bullet has spoken. You know, there's there's, there's going to be a concert actually on a tribute. A yes, tribute. a tribute today. Today? To, yeah, the 24th? concert is today. No, no. no, the funeral is on 24th and the concert is today. Oh. Today? Yes. Ah, uh, well, I okay, don't know, all we know about is the a date, concert. but all we know that there's a concert, a tribute yeah, concert to, yeah, for Ebony. Anna, Ebony. And Ebony. there's also Ebony. a foundation to help raise money to take care of accident victims, which is a, a very good move. It's, yeah, it's a very good move from the camp. But then again, Bullet says some people were asking for money to perform at the tribute. Yes. So what would you make of this? People who were at the one week um, celebration yes. to pour out their hearts and their condolences for the family of the late Ebony are now demanding money. According for, to Bullet, please. According to Bullet, <laughs> yes, according to Bullet, they are demanding money to step on that stage to have the concert mm -hmm. uh, being done. And to me, well, it's a two-way situation for me. Bullet mm -hmm. could have give, I mean, could give the money to them. Well, it's it's a tribute. Those who are How will you feel well, taking you know, money you know, to sometimes pay a tribute to, to someone? I know, but sometimes you need to look at the whole individual, the whole uh, package coming on that 
day to perform you know people have mouth to feed people have people to take care of family so sometimes actually people might have some serious gig outside you know which is more than what is going to happen but you know okay. it's just a compensation for them to step on that stage but well, there's a rumor that okay people were spreading rumors that Shatawali was the one demanding for the money and now he has and now he's angry you don't mess with Shatawali like that you don't actually, mess with his brand actually, Shatawali shouldn't be blamed because Shatawa has a very different um, um, matter to take care of because yes. he's about to release his album, his album. He's been the working rain, so hard on the it. rain after the storm the rain. the rain so he's working too much so much and uh, actually um, he is outside the country pursuing some uh, duties there I think yeah, he, first movie, some yeah, yeah, first yeah. video coming out so big house to Shatawa wherever you are big house yes. to you I have to see your fans and the shatter movement. All right, so let's go to Parliament. Where have you heard there's been an increase in teenage pregnancies in the country? There, there's actually been an increase in teenage, teenage pregnancy in the actually, country. Not in the country, but yes. you know, there are some parts of the world they don't even have the education, yeah. and that is rampant, you know. And this minister has come to yeah, the minister for North Day MP, the MP for North Day, Joyce mm -hmm. Lane, says she's asking that sex education be included in the educational curriculum which is a great move because i think last year we recorded a very very high number of teenage pregnancies in ghana mm -hmm. and then there was a story that the ucc students were sleeping with some of the uh, kids alleged. the children mm -hmm. the females in the central region it was alleged that some yeah. of the uc students were sleeping with them so i think it's a good call from so sex the minister education being, uh, included in our curri uh, uh, educational, educational curriculum, curriculum. yes wow, but then we have rme too so why not just no we have biology Okay, you have RME in the, in the basic school. You have in the yeah, basic school. That's yeah. what she meant. Okay, if if it's in the educational curriculum, I well, I think you should start from the basic. Cause if you get it from the basic, okay, then so you when you grow up, you already have the basic. Social studies. Yes, you have social. We but have biology. Think, of course. But then the RME shapes you more because it's more about morality. No, I know, but you know the RME only talks about social, social this, don't do this, moral. But with the sex uh, education, I think it's going to delve deeper because uh, my, you don't know someone at ten, someone at nine, you wouldn't think the person would know about sex education. But I mean, introducing that um, mm -hmm. subject or that um, whole move is going to help the person even know how to practice it and even to abstain yes. so i think it's a good move good and then move, yeah move, some of move. the mps were also saying condoms should be shared to the students well i don't mind which, which is not bad I don't mind. some people can't abstain so why not just give them yeah, the condom to mind. do whatever they want to do I don't mind. you need to yes. even teach I'll you have to share it because even in the university during some of the hall weeks they share condom of course, you need so to. Uh, you i know, think it's you, a you good call from parliament and from the mps they're doing well that Concerning teenagers, you yes, know, you may think they don't know, but hey, they will even teach you. <laughs> so I think it's a good move. The condom sharing, the uh, the inclusion of the sex education, yes. big move. And children use it. Use the condom, right? Use hey, it. rightly, you don't. Yes, <laughs> use it. If you can't stay away, just use it. I mean, if you to avoid any trouble. Yes. Yes. Avoid any trouble. Yeah. So that will be all for social media trends on Biza TV. Yes. My name Bezat is Abigail Mao. And I'm Therese Say. Bye bye. Catch us next time.